Hi, this uh, video tutorial just gives an overview of how to generate a mechanical ventilation fenestration report. Right, in the previous movie we created a project um, and one building and two stories within that project. And looking at the story, um, I've got two rooms um, giving a total floor area. Um, then also I have two fenestration elements, uh, window one and window two. However, the facade numbers haven't been completed uh, with the fenestration element as it hasn't been linked or to a uh, facade area. Now the facade areas are basically required to do mechanical ventilation and typically that is uh, the outside um, wall of or the area of the outside elevation of the wall. So if I have four, or if, I was got, if I've got a square uh, or rectangular building, I will have four um, elements. One north facing, south facing, uh, east and west. As an example. Right, um, then these are unique identifiers. If you do have a um, a U-shaped building and it's north facing you might have three north facades um, and that's why um, you just give a north one and the next one will be north two. Right so I'm going to just open up um, this slightly so I can see uh, what I'm doing and I'll just scroll down to uh, complete the orientations. All right then uh, the heights um, and the length uh, I need to complete and um, just to show you, I've selected one element here. Hold down Shift and click the last. Uh, it multi-selects all of those. And I can put in uh, a story height um, that just applies to all four. It's a quick uh, t t time saver. Right, so I'm going to just say that's seven meters and these are five meters. Building being north uh, facing. Right, so that uh, gets completed. And um, a good idea now is to just save. Right, once you've saved, um, you can go back to the uh, fenestration elements or the windows and you can, um, just this being selected, you can either type in, um, it's a north orientated uh, fenestration element, so you can either type in a similar uh, value than the facade um, or you can select the item and then uh, at the top here go and uh, select from the drop down list and uh, then say apply um, and it'll just complete it. This obviously also works nicely if you've got multiple uh, items selected you just uh, add your uh, fenestration uh, facade number and apply and it'll apply to the multiple um, inputs. Right so once that's done you can save again and you're now ready to do the um, report. So it's basically just linking either the windows, doors or glazed uh, walls to a facade. Right, uh, going to the report, and just to uh, show you that, if I go to the uh, dwelling and I can go to the mechanical uh, area, um, basically there's story one, and um, I uh, don't have any uh, items on east, south, or, or uh, west, so just focusing on the north um, uh, elevation. Um, there's two windows, each one has its uh, energy uh, value and if I add that up um, it is below the allowable um, based on the facade and uh, that's then compliant. All right, um, each of these elevations needs to comply for the total report to uh, comply. All right, so basically that um, this concludes this um, movie uh, explaining mechanical uh, fenestration calculations.